Hi guys, welcome to Law C D Three Years Podcast Video. Today we have a uh, Vashnavi Desuza, and uh, she is from Mumbai itself, Mumbai, Maharashtra. She joined us for the live class preparation, and she scored triple one, one 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 out of one fifty marks in M S C D Law Three Years Two Thousand Twenty Two Examination. So first of all, Vashnavi, congratulations for your score. Thank you, sir. So before we jump to the question, as you mentioned, I mean. थोड़ा सा रिग्रेट रह गया है कि स्कोर मेरा कम आया है तो yeah. क्या लगता है रीजंस क्या हो सकते हैं आई मीन व्हाई यू आर थिंकिंग कि स्कोर कम है रीजंस आर लाइक फर्स्टली अबाउट लीगल जीके दिस टाइम लीगल जीके वाज क्वाइट अ लॉट इट वाज नॉट लाइक द प्रीवियस पेपर्स व्हिच हैड ओनली प्रिंसिपल एंड फैक्ट बेस्ड क्वेश्चंस सो आई फील लीगल जीके समहाउ वाज अ डिफिकल्ट पार्ट फॉर मी There were there were different questions this time, so hmm. or because of that and maybe also because of GK, uh, there was no current affairs this time. It was full static GK. So because of these two subjects, maybe somewhere I might have lost few marks. Logic oh. and English was quite uh, easy. Paper was uncertain. No, बहुत ही unexpected yeah. questions they had asked. Yeah, and the paper setter was quite obsessed with I guess family law. <laughs> this time there were a lot of questions from family law. Okay, okay. So you think because of GK and the legal part, you legal GK, yeah. Uh, your score is less. And apart from that, what do you think? What are the mistakes you have done? Which uh, I mean, I mean, um, which one should not do if they are preparing for the CET? Just because the score upa kam aya and uh, yeah. This now this year I feel the paper was quite different. I don't know if next year it would be same, but still. people who are preparing for next year they should uh, study legal gk like the current legal knowledge which is going on basic knowledge of uh, high courts jurisdiction whichever high court uh, are there latest judgment basically and, yeah and uh, cases like marital uh, rape which was asked in the paper so mm. some legal gk knowledge should be there family law should not be skipped you have to study that and yes. uh, for gk right. i guess it is quite uncertain anything can come so it is difficult to prepare for gk but still try to read everything whatever you can obviously this year that is why we this year we have added family law muslim law hindu yeah. law legal gk also we have added in the mock because paper change ho gaya hai so mock yes, bhi, question bhi change kar diye aur aapka jo bhi mock is saal ka jo ban raha hai us tarah se ban raha hai logic mein bhi kafi naye questions aaye the is baar but logic was manageable it was yeah manageable. it was easy yeah ki padha hai humne aata hai easy hai kar lenge thoda different tha paper no doubt but easy tha uh, yeah yeah doable tha okay so before we jump to the further question thoda sa aapke bare mein introduction de do academic background kya tha aapka and how law three years idea came into the picture yeah. how you got to know about us manuar so this i recently graduated from ity college in bsc okay. and now i'm wait uh, as sir said i got 111 in ct and i'm waiting for my admission process uh huh this is my basic background i have been uh, as a science student for 5 years now but i suddenly decided to go for law because law had many subjects which gives us different opportunities to try so i thought of going for law now science se seedha law pe jump bahut yeah jaldi pun change kar diya aapne to yeah what is the feeling after this change it is uh it is a mixed feeling because uh, there are people who say that a uh, science and law is quite different so you are taking a big leap of changing things and the way of studying is also different but i felt that this was giving me a good opportunity to explore my skills so i thought of going for law okay 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 so have you got to know about minua uh by watching your youtube videos okay we did videos oh, yeah youtube videos okay so as you mentioned initially ki aapne bahut sare podcast last year dekhe the and all so yeah. That time had you thought of that? Or maybe, maybe one day podcast will be done, and such my video will come. No, no, no. Okay. I did not know that I might, you know, go for a podcast here. But uh, yeah, the podcast was quite good last year. Once everyone were quite informative. So okay, so it really helped us. In terms of what? Uh, in terms of how to solve the uh, mock test, or you know, how to prepare for certain topics. 
Uh, mm-hmm. where you should use more of your time in solving such uh, like logic needs a lot of your time or a gk how much you have to prepare for gk mm-hmm. so it uh, did help me a lot also there were few videos which uh, manuers team had made about uh, how to study gk and current affairs so that helped okay great great so this is what the motive behind the podcast keep on doing such kind of a podcast so that upcoming year aspirant get benefited from these podcasts and uh, they don't do the mistake which previous people have done and uh, they should perform well in the examination basically okay so let's talk about uh, preparation part H- have you made any kind of a schedule like morning mein english then afternoon mein or gk then logic was there no. any schedule no uh and no i did not have a certain schedule but yeah uh, studying every day was a part of my schedule i would say because i had my graduation exam till march so i started preparing up from april onwards okay. and uh, it was quite easy because after that cet was postponed so i got a lot of time to study mm-hmm. for this exam mm-hmm. and uh, everything like legal uh, legal uh, whatever lectures were going on you just study in that lecture and you're done with it and the rest topics even if you study for one or two hours it is sufficient i feel it is sufficient because you don't have to prepare so much but uh, there are few things you need to like follow every day reading a newspaper and you know uh, solving few questions from logic maybe if you have time or sun- saturday or sunday is also fine okay. it depends if consi- being consistent is uh, better so apne you must have got entire manual book you got the video access yeah. wo kitna helpful hua aapke preparation ko leke aur uh, how much you got confident ki ha mera score bhi acha aa raha hai no kitna helpful tha material yeah no, uh, the recorded lectures or uh, the live after the live lectures there were recorded lectures so those lectures were quite helpful for uh, especially for the logic part uh, the short tricks which were taught they were easy to you know solve the questions and mm-hmm. even in legal uh, part if you say the uh, the lectures were quite good so it helped in completing the syllabus yes. gk was also quite easy and uh, there were few short videos which you can watch for uh, like revision wise you need to have a shortcuts for all the subject and for the topic which i mean which are there basically because you yeah. have to save time because in ct there is a no, there is no time you have to run basically yes, it's all about time yeah. management Okay. Okay. How many mock tests you had appeared? Uh, there were fifteen mock tests on the portal, I guess. So I appeared almost ten or twelve, mostly. I could appear at least ten to twelve mock tests. Okay. And what was your highest score in the mock? If you remember. I never touched. I never touched above hundred. I guess I was uh, around ninety three to ninety five every oh. time. So it was that. If we yeah. uh, okay, if we compare then. Plus fifteen marks you got in the real yeah. examination one one one, okay ninety five the high if the ninety five is the highest okay so what if you compare the CT paper and the manual mock what differences you have uh, Man- manual marks were a bit difficult to uh, solve maybe because it was one step higher uh, CT was comparatively easy. Mm-hmm. and uh, the logical part was also easy for CT exams at least this year it was easy. So uh-huh. English was also quite easy in CET. So, what are the things which you have learned after writing the couple of mock tests, which help you in the real examination? Uh, firstly, time management. Like, uh, you have to start, uh, with GK or whatever, whichever subject you like, but you have to solve it quickly so that you know don't waste your time on one question. Mm-hmm. And I used to solve it in two parts. Like, first solve the whole paper. and mm-hmm. then uh, you can mark the questions which uh, you don't know so mm-hmm. then come back to those and solve it again so that was uh, and this time it was section based so it was quite easy for me to solve the questions okay and even okay. checking the mistakes was also a uh, quite good because uh, really there were a few questions which was same from the mock test okay uh, from gk i guess okay so, it was same exactly came from yeah from the like test. like some i guess from blue revolution or something uh-huh. something like that was there in the ct exam one okay. or two questions i think they were same even from english okay analogy based questions so okay. there are few questions which come directly in ct i don't know how but uh, yeah there was there were questions this is what the benefit 
ओके ओके इफ यू राइट मैन्युअल मॉक देन आई मीन दिस इज हैपनिंग देन दैट इज गुड दो तीन मार्क्स एक्स्ट्रा ही मिलेंगे एंड ऑब्वियसली यू प्रैक्टिस द मॉक यू लर्न फ्रॉम द मॉक यू अंडरस्टैंड योर डिफिकल्टी इजी स्ट्रेंथ एंड वीकनेसेस यू अंडरस्टैंड द इंटरफेस जो सॉफ्टवेयर है वो भी इंपॉर्टेंट है समझना टू हाउ टू मैनेज टाइम एंड ऑल सो व्हाट लास्ट क्वेश्चन व्हाट टिप्स और सजेशन यू वांट टू गिव टू अपकमिंग ईयर एस्पिरेंट व्हाट आर टारगेटिंग फॉर सीटी 2023 24 25 uh be consistent and hard working obviously if you study every day even if one or two hours it is sufficient but you need to study every day and also don't skip any part at least go through it once so that by chance if there are new questions you'll know what you have to you know you have a basic idea that what you can answer and there's a good thing about ct that there is no negative marking so you can at least give a guess if you don't know anything about it Yeah, that is that is one thing. Okay, so be consistent or thodi jaldi preparation chalu karo, mehnat karte raho or uh, revision karte raho. Do write the mock, do have a detailed analysis, yeah. and be confident. Ye sab chize kar rahe ho to definitely you will be cracking CET with the good score and finally end up with the colleges which you are dreaming for like JLC, ILS or any other colleges. So that's all in this podcast. Thank you, Vashna, for coming and sharing your Thank experience. Thank you, sir. you're welcome and once again congratulations for your score and uh, top 3 college may for sure you will get the admission that's all and all the best for your career thank you sir yeah chalo bye bye bye